Good morning. Here we are in Stowe. Uh, you would have seen the Airbnb yesterday, which is just behind me. Uh, we're just leaving now. Um, it's around lunchtime. It's about 12 o'clock, half 12. Um, it's quite a nice day. A uh, little cloudy, isn't it, Lou? Yeah. Where are you? There you are. There you go. And there's Megan. Cool. So we're going to leave now. We're going to jump in the car. We're going to go down to Stowe. Stowe's not very big. Um, it's only got inhabitants of 600 people. Um, but it's very touristy, obviously, for the ski season. Okay, so we just stopped for a bit of lunch in... Peace Milk Pies. In Stowe. Okay. Just on the main street. Yeah, English style pies. Mm. <laughs> so we've travelled, yeah, yeah two and a half thousand miles <laughs> to eat pie and mash. Okay. Can we eat them? <laughs> yeah, we can eat them. This is like parsnip mm -hmm. potato mash. Oh my god. Is that nice? Yeah, it is. Okay. Just remember who's behind the camera. We also need to eat some of this. So, this is rabbit cider gravy. Oh my god. Is that nice? And the pie? And then the pie. What was the pie again? It was cheese, artichoke, and potato. Mm. You better dive in. This is a whipped maple ice cream. It's amazing. I was going to have the cake batter, but then he said try the maple. So, and then we all ended up, well, three of us ended up having the maple. Megan's got s'mores flavoured ice cream. Oh, wow. And then Lewis has got a cookie dough. Cookie dough, let's have a look at your ice cream. drive around Vermont this afternoon. It is a beautiful afternoon. We've got the drone in the car. We've got Henry and Megan with us and we're just having a little mooch around on the back roads and we found this amazing little red covered bridge. I don't think I've ever seen anything like it. Apart from, Megan reckons, the film Beetlejuice? Hmm. So, let's go and have a look. A confession. I don't know if it's a confession. I'm not not proud of it. I have always been somewhat of a Sound of Music fan. I've been to Salzburg, um, done the dancing around the fountain thing, and when I discovered by accident that actually the the Von Trapp family lodge is here near Stowe in Vermont where we're staying, it was kind of inevitable that we'd end up here and that I'd drag some of them with me. So here we are. Very exciting. <laughs> the 
Is this somewhere where we can get a coffee and some kuchen? Um, I didn't ask because there, there was a queue there, but there's nothing in there. There's a gift shop. Is that? Which... <laughs> Like but they don't take any credit cards or cash, unfortunately, Louise. So, <laughs> what do you do, eh? Um, yeah. I think the coffee shop back there, yeah, the coffee house, coffee house, yeah, is um, is good. Okay. Okay. Should we go and get a cup of tea then? So, the Airbnb that we're staying in tonight, I have been, and we will do it for three nights. So we stayed last night, we're here tonight, and we've got another night, and then we're moving on to Cape Cod. Um, but the kids said, can we light the fire? Can we do s'mores again, like we did in the previous place? And I'm like, yeah, it's fine. If you can find the, the, the firewood, etc., to get it lit, off you go. Um, and it's a reasonably sized plot. It's about an acre, I think, here. Anyway, so off they've gone and created a fire um, which to my personal opinion is an impressive feat so look at that and they're going up into the woods just up there to go and get stuff and then bring it down so we are definitely making s'mores tonight after we've had our dinner well done then let me just show you good evening end of the second day in Vermont. Vermont, yeah. So we had um, quite a good day today. Um, we had a bit of a lazy morning, as you know, and then we uh, headed into town. Um, where are we again? <laughs> I forget. <laughs> in Stowe. In Stowe, in, Stowe in, in Vermont. Vermont. Thank you, Megan. Thank you, Megan. Uh, <laughs> so we're in Stowe, it's a pretty little main street. Um, and then we headed off to the Red Bridge and had a look at the Red Bridge. Um, and then... Uh, Trap Family Lodge, don't forget about that. Oh, yeah, then we headed up to the Trap Family Lodge. So that was our day today. Uh, tomorrow we are heading towards the lake, out and getting bitten. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're doing the mosquito dance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow we're doing, we're still in Vermont tomorrow. We're still in the same accommodation tomorrow night and we're going to Waterbury. We've got the Ben and Jerry's factory tomorrow. And also we're hoping to get out on the lake for a bit. Ben and Jerry's tomorrow. Yeah. Very but we're going to go because Sparks came. It's Get in! in. <laughs> Ow! Buggers are good again. Okay, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Good morning. Another day in Vermont. And we are running out of the house at about 10 past 7 in the morning to go and get a coffee without any children in tow. So two of them are still asleep and the other one is just waking up. So we thought, I'd rather not disturb them. Let's, uh, me and Louise just, oh, here we go. Me and Louise go and grab some uh, coffee by ourselves. What do you reckon, Lou? Mm in uh, Waterbury Reservoir, which is a state park. Yeah. It costs us $4 each to get in, yeah. but over 14s. Yeah, yeah. And it's really pretty. I like that house. Wow. Yeah, I've just eyeballed that house too. Yeah. Up there. It's really pretty. And it's nice with the grey sky, actually. Yeah, it's not too hot. Yeah. 
So our plan is to get on the lake one way or the other, yeah. or in the lake, more likely. This is really hard work. Isn't it Lou? This is ex this is exhausting. <laughs> Right, we are in Waterbury on the reservoir. Uh, like Louis said, it was a, it's a state-run park. It costs us around $16-ish to get in, $4 each-ish. Um, anyway, so we've got the paddle boards out, as you can see. So there's the kiddos. Hello, my girl. And there's the boys up there. They're doing really well. Um, it's going to rain in a minute. And it's only pretty much us on the river, on the reservoir. Yeah, it's really quiet today. It's really quiet today, and I think all the locals have gone, well, I'm going on there, it's going to rain. Well, they've probably been here all weekend, then. So, we're going to head out round the reservoir. We've got about two hours on here. Um, as you can see, I'm doing all the paddling. I'm doing all the work, as usual. No comment from behind. <laughs> Right, do you want me to record it now? Ah. Okay, so we've just had an amazing time down at that state park uh, on the paddle boards. Um, and the kayak or the two-man canoe so we've just nipped in on the way back on recommendation of um, a local guy that I bumped into chatting um, cider hollow cider house and it's literally just across the road from where we pulled out so apparently in here they've got famous donuts apple cider donuts um, so we're going to dive in there, we're going to grab a coffee because we're a bit hungry after that exercise. We're not used to it on this all day, travelling around. So uh, here we go, let's have a look. Oh my god, it smells so good in here. It smells? <laughs> it's an apple pie. It's an pie. apple and cinnamon pie. That's amazing. I think I might have found my heaven. Look at all of this maple. Zero. I'm going to have a maple french roast. It's not making me feel happy, I can't wait to eat it. It smells nice. <laughs> Apple cider donut. I come in peace. Mm -hmm. mm. What's it like? It's like a donut. Warm? Warm-ish, a little. Megan, what do you think? Fine. <laughs> For a teenager, that's actually a good response. <laughs> Where have you brought me to now, Louise? So, we're just arriving at the Ben & Jerry's factory tour experience. Ooh. Good. And what treat were... the kids from grandma and granddad. They free up the tickets in like a weekly thing. So you have to go in a week before and they'll free up the tickets for that day. Um, but they went really quickly. So you have to be a bit quick. Mm, 
really good. We saw the factory floor where we couldn't film in there. Um, and the tanks and the flavour lab. And now we're trying a flavour that you can't buy in a pint. You can only buy it here in the scoop shop, which is sweet cream and cookies. And we got given some little cookie dough chunks upstairs. <laughs> End of day five. <laughs> We're Imposter. so good at knowing what day it is. <laughs> yeah, we haven't been tracking it like the Camino, so no, uh, so it's fine. That, that's our forgiveness. Okay, so we've had a good day today. What have you done? We went for coffee. We went to the water sports place to the reservoir to do some um, paddle boarding and kayaking, which was amazing. It was so nice, really oh, relaxing. Yeah. yeah. Then uh, before we carry on, what I must say is. If you've skipped to this part and haven't watched the previous footage, the, it was so quiet. Oh, so peaceful. There was only birds mm. that we could hear on that water, mm. minus the kids. Um, mm. But when the kids were quiet, it was absolutely stunning and it was just so peaceful. I think we'll do that again. <laughs> we're going to do that again. Mm. That's definitely on the list again. Yeah. So. But onwards we must go, and tomorrow we're travelling on to Cape Cod, mm. to the coast. So we'll go from, we've been inland and green for the last few days, and we're going off to the coast, so that'll be a nice change of pace. It's near the beach. But we haven't said anything yet about the sharks and the kids, so... <laughs> we'll tell them tomorrow. We'll tell them when we take them to the beach. <laughs> anyway. We are responsible parents, we promise. <laughs> we are. Anyway, right, we'll leave you for today and yeah. we will see you tomorrow. Bye.